uh, because I've, um, I've seen I've seen you guys doing stuff which I haven't told you, but still you're doing it, but it's not wrong. But we just have to mention it. With the Kudu Bibah as well, it's not about just hitting down here. It's um, it's all of here. As long as you're not hitting the knee, that's fine. All of our feet, the Kudu Bibah. Or if you want to do it, it doesn't matter. All right? Okay. Kudu Bibah. Um, sweep. Uh, we're not gonna look at the sweep at first, um, but I can show you the sweep. The sweep we, it will happen when you're kind of like in fighting when you're a bit close. You can you can get a sweep, um, uh, but in training I don't recommend it that much. So most of the time you are here in fighting, and then you decided okay I'm gonna go for a sweep and that's when it's boom. And then you got all of this business going, right? It's either this way if your legs are yeah. coming, or it's either on the other side. Yeah? Okay, now we're going to try and look at them ticks, how we're going to combine them with punches and double them up, triple them up, jumping and spinning and everything. <laughs> so, um, yeah, so um, the first one we're going to look for, obviously because we start with the foyte, so we're going to start with the foyte again and we're going to add, uh, let's say, um, a chassis back with the foyte. So it's going to be a foyte back plus a chassis back. But also we're going to do the one, two first and then foyte and then chassis back. So, Literally, if I do it slowly, this is what I want you to do. So you're gonna go one, two, wait back, step, chassis back. That's all I want you to do. Slowly, two, three, and four. Got that? Yeah, we have you with that? 